All right, cool. Yeah, I'm gonna look into it and then um, I'm gonna see what I can do for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, bro. Just, just pack a meal in the back of the minivan. Jim, just. Oh, hold on. I just had some stuff pop up. I'll call you back here in a second. Hey, Mr. Sanders, long time no see. No, yeah, how's it going? Good, how are you doing? Good. Hey, man, I know last time getting the approval was not how we thought. I finally saved up some extra money, and I, I, think, I think it's time to try again. Back to the video today. <laughs> Three, two, one. Officially, welcome back to today's video, guys. Now, the one thing about the 350Z is I feel like you guys have just not seen it fully detailed enough. So, what I want to do for today's video is I really just want to give you a walk around of the 350Z so you guys get to see what it looks like because it's so mint. I can't even procrastinate. I mean, I can't even f predict. What I'm about to say right now because I'm so twisted. Nah. <laughs> no, but the 350Z looks so good and I feel like I look at it so often that you guys just don't get enough uh, view of it and I feel like this will really bring you in to how far the Z looks with just wheels, guys, and we're just getting started. Stone and I have ordered... Never mind. Next video. Stone and I have been working and planning out this car. So guys, this build is my fourth build. If you guys have been following, you guys know. This is what it's looking like so far. Come up closer and... Or wait. So... I want to be out of the frame. This is what the 350Z looks like. It sits nice. Honestly, I'm pretty freaking happy with how it is right now. So I kind of just want to go over where the car is at and how you guys could get your car to this point if you have a 350Z and maybe any other car. So let's say, you know, you like the looks of this car. Well, the mods I have done on it, you can do to any other car and you can get to the same point to the same hype stage in building a car as the 350z is right now so as you guys know we went with the dso2 wheels in a bronze wheel with a machined lift now honestly i was not planning this I was not planning this but with the way that it turned out honestly i'm super super happy and it just dialed in my my like plan um no, 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 no. Ideas? Education on, it really just locked in my education on wheels, how wheel specs work, the sizing, the offset, what that does to a wheel. So it really just helped me out a lot in uh, putting the wheels on the car. So every time you do it, you get better. Either way, the tires look so good. They're wrapped in a Falcon tire, which honestly the tread, I'm really loving it. So some pieces of the body kit that actually came on the car has been the V2 Nismo front bumper, uh, the V1, style side skirts moving over to the back here we have the rear spats those are super fire i believe those are v2 as well as you guys see the duck bill now the duck lip duck bill is pretty fire um low-key gonna be changing that out so if any of you guys want it might be selling it in the future probably will be so stay tuned for that threw a likewise sticker up here so check that out as far as the exhaust goes if you guys like the sound of the 350z <laughs> That is because we have a Nismo catback exhaust and we have the Burke high flow cats. You put those together, you're gonna produce the sound that you guys hear in my videos. I actually really love it. I love the Burke high flow cats. I, I probably will swap out the exhaust. That's a future video. Don't wanna dig too much into that because there's kind of a lot that goes in that and I have a lot of opinion about it, but let's hop over to the front of the Z again. So 
the 350Z actually has some bumper, front bumper issues. And here's why, because there's a bottom plate skid guard that goes on the bottom of the car here. It attaches to the bumper, but where the bumper attached to it, it actually stripped out due to the bumper being fiberglass and it's taken so much heat. It's barely hanging on and we need to fix it guys. I have parts coming in so I'm excited to further update you guys on that. So don't think the 350Z build is slowing down at all because we're going 100% and I'm gonna build this as fast as possible. It's gonna be sick. There's also some canards on the car. I don't know if I'm gonna transfer those to the next bumper or not but when we get there we'll see. I'll kind of line it up so you guys can see as well. Come over here real fast and I wanted to show you one last thing. Actually two last things. Let me pop the hood. Ah, hot! As you guys know, we've cleaned the car a few times. The last thing we haven't cleaned is under the hood, so don't judge me there, but check this out. We have the Cusco strut bar. We've swapped out the filter here with a blue one, and it matches the Cusco strut bar. I think it's super fire. That is basically all the performance mods we have is a full exhaust and an air intake. Keys. Throw it. Record it. Throw it. All right. It looks dope. <laughs> yeah. It's a fucking super. <laughs> Dude, did I throw you the Subaru keys? And I'm trying to put them in. <laughs> <laughs> my bad, dog. You said, wait, I, I couldn't even get them in. Hold on, bro. Oh my gosh. Do I look really hot on that? Yeah, you look like I'm sexy, sweating. dude. Oh, I meant I'm sweating. Oh, <laughs> my bad. Cut that out. <laughs> the last thing I wanted to show you guys with the 350Z is the interior. Let me hop out and show this real fast. So you can see it from this angle. The red seats are so fire. Stone just cleaned it today. This is what the car looks like in detail. Uh, I love everything about it. Okay, let's hop in. It's hot. <laughs> it's probably 100 degrees here, huh? Yeah. Maybe like 110, dude sexy outside <laughs> it seriously looks so aggressive in every angle you know what i mean like even from the dash here it's just sharp everything right here is just sharp but this is the center console we have the likewise setup here i really love this it actually honestly helps me shift just because the leverage of it all of it's super clean the gauges all work this is the steering column the 350z steering wheel we will be changing that out we got the likewise lanyard hanging here a little phone mount it's a two-seater so there's a sub back there but other than that guys this is what the interior looks like oh we sticker slapped Right here. What's going on here? I don't know. It's blown out. Maybe we'll, well maybe I'll show you another day. I got film of it already. Oh, okay, bet. See, I think we got one. This sound like quill. This shit go dummy dummy. Yo, what's up? Yo, what's up? Welcome back to the videos. Welcome back to the videos. I'm River Sanders' cousin. I'm River Sanders' cousin. And this is what we do at my house. And this is what we do at my house. <laughs> now they want to ride.